Hello friend, in this video lecture, I'm going to prove that tan alpha minus beta equal to sine 2 beta divided by 5 minus cos 2 beta. Here the given is 2 tan alpha equal to 3 tan beta. So let's uh, see the answer here. This is the given 2 tan alpha equal to 3 tan beta. Or we can try to this tan alpha equal to 3 by 2 tan beta. Now here I am going to take the LHS left hand side tan alpha minus beta. So we already know tan a minus b tan a minus tan b divided by 1 plus tan into tan b. So we can write tan alpha minus tan beta divided by 1 plus tan alpha into tan beta. In place of tan alpha, we can write 3 by 2 tan beta because on the right side, it's all in the form of beta. So we can write 3 by 2 tan beta minus tan beta, just right. Now 1 plus 3 by 2 tan beta into tan beta. Now I'm going to solve this. So here going to take the LCM. So LCM will become 2. So we can write 3 tan beta. 2 is the LCM to multiply with this. So here it comes 2 tan beta. Divide by 2 plus 3 tan square beta by 2. 2 to that cancel. Here that comes 3 tan beta minus 2 tan beta. That comes tan beta and here after 2 plus 3 tan square beta now we need to change this in the sine cos form so we can write uh, tan beta equal to sine beta by cos beta divide by 2 plus 3 sine square beta by cos square beta now here sine beta that going to write sin beta divided by cos beta here this is the lcm 2 1 lcm 2 here that to 2 cos square beta that come 3 sin square beta divided by cos square beta this will cancel now this will go up because if the form anything like p by q x by y so here pq that come y that go up x down now hereafter so it comes sine beta into cos beta now here 2 cos a square beta plus 3 sin a square beta now we know that cos 2 beta is equal to 2 cos a square beta minus 1 not plus minus 1 so here cos square beta we can write 1 plus cos 1 plus cos 2 beta divided by 2 now here cos 2 beta we can also write 1 minus 2 sin square beta so here we can use uh, sin square beta we can write 1 okay sin square beta we can write 1 minus cos 2 beta by 2 so here this is going to take the this will go on the right side 1 minus 2 that go down now here sin beta cos beta right and here it's all in the form of sin 2a cos 2a okay so here in place of cos square we can write 1 plus cos 2 beta divided by 2 and for sin square we can write 1 minus cos 2 beta divided by 2 
now hereafter so here let's take the LCM sin beta cos beta now here 2 that multiply with this and 2 that multiply with 2 cos 2 beta and uh, 3 that to multiply so 3 cos 2 beta and down 2 is there now here after the next is so here after there is 2 so 2 that move up so here that come 2 sin beta cos beta now here 2 2 plus 3 that come 5 and 2 cos beta minus 3 cos 2 beta that come minus cos 2 beta and 2 sin a into cos a that come sin 2 a that is sin 2 beta so here this one 5 minus cos 2 beta so this we need to this is the target we have to do that so finally got so here you can see 5 sin 2 beta my, divide by 5 minus cos 2 beta so 2 sin a into cos a that comes sin 2 a beta is there so we can write beta and here after that 2 uh, that go up and 2 sin a into cos a here we can 2 plus 3 that is 5 and here 2 cos 2 beta minus 3 sin 3 cos 2 beta that subtract then cos 2 beta that come and here what i did multiply this all with 2 and uh, 2 is the only on both so here 2 is the lcm theory that multiply and here i just uh, converted this is the formula cos 2 beta equal to 2 cos square beta minus 1 so cos square that taken this on the right side that might move to with this so it this is the minus that go and convert into plus and to that down so here cos 2 beta this is the formula 1 minus 2 sin square beta so in place of sin square beta we have to change in the form of cos 2 beta and uh, this is the way we can uh, prove this kind of question so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you